Well, our relationship with Tata Steel happened about two years ago when Wayne Garrett called me and said that they needed fall protection training. And then uh, just recently got a phone call from Mark at Tata Steel and said they've identified a hazard and they need us to come back and to offer suggestions on how to control uh, this hazard. We had recently made an investment on one of our plating lines to uh, upgrade the terminal equipment. And one of the things that was overlooked was, if you think about when you put platforms up, you provide good fall protection on the outside of platforms, but anytime any work was going to be done on the interior, we did not have the proper fall protection that would protect the worker if a, an opening would open up in the center of that platform. And that's when we brought Mazella in and said, look, we need to come up with a solution for fall protection whenever that, that platform is opened up so that nobody could fall down through there. Mark had explained that removing these rollers using a crane, once that roller was out, there was a 40 to 50 foot drop and the guy could fall in there. So through the training that he received a couple of years ago, was able to say, hey, we need to control or eliminate that hazard. And so we had offered them the, the TravSafe lifeline system to control that area. This system is able to go at a 90 degree angle and continue up and all the way around this iron that they have surrounding these rolls. It was just tailor-made for this area and he had said, yeah, this is great, let's do it. Some of the other applications that we had guys working up on boilers, they were having to move different platforms into position. It was very labor intensive to set up so they could do the work on top of the boilers. Now the lifeline system that's being put in there is more of a permanent setup that the guys can very easily go up there and do the work by tying off, have that fall protection, which is, is required to, to work on top of the boilers. Another application that we have it was actually a system that we had put in homemade with a lifeline system. When I presented that to, to Mozilla to have that certified, and they said, well, what's your specs for that lifeline that you guys installed? I said, well, it was not really, it was not made to any specification. We needed a lifeline, so we put one up. And that was when Mazella said, look, there's a much better system out there for you that we can certify. That, that once we put it in, rest assured, anybody could come in and know that, hey, this is, this is not a homemade system, that it's something that, you know, they're gonna put their stamp of approval on and, and certify it. It's very difficult in this day and age working with, with OSHA and how the requirements always change. And that's why it's good to partner with somebody that knows the regs and knows how they're changing. So when you start to look for different safety equipment, you gotta partner up with somebody like Mozilla that knows the regs so that you don't get somebody that, yeah, gives you a low bid, yet would not meet the requirements. That's, that's the word of caution I give before you dive into letting somebody come in and just put something up for you.